Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome to another tutorial on Microsoft Flight Simulator, how to locate your community folder. This has uh, been a lot of videos on YouTube explaining on Microsoft side, Steam side. But today I have a simple, really simple tutorial on you, how to locate it right away. No need to go on directories and folders and folders and folders looking for hours. So this is a really simple tutorial and I'm going to show you how to install any custom aircraft on the on the uh, flightsim.to website. It's pretty simple. We're going to be installing the C-17 Glowmaster. It's a pretty cool plane. Um, this is obviously a community made plane. So let's get into it. So first step you need to do is go to options. Go to general options and open the developers tab and you're going to turn on the developer mode on. Once you have it on, you should have a little bar in the top. You're going to go to tools, you're going to go to a virtual file system, and you're going to go to the package folders, and you're going to open community folder. What this is going to do, this is going to open the community, the actual community folder for the Steam version. I do not know if this works for the Microsoft version, but this is confirmed for the Steam version. This opens your directory, community folder directory for your uh, custom files. As you guys can see, I already have some files here already installed. Um, and I'm going to show you these planes, how they look on the game. So I turn off my developer mode, go back home, apply and save. Just going to create a route somewhere or just open the flight uh, things over here. So I have this A330-900 uh, Airbus right here. Um, the other aircraft that I currently have is a 7, uh, 767. And the other custom one is the CP140. Uh, uh, I use it, you know, to fly around in the national or the, you know, you know what this plane is to locate a hurricane, the Hurricane Hunter. There it is. They have the old color and the new color. Uh, links are going to be down in the description if you guys want to get these planes. I think I only have one plane installed, which is or two planes installed, which is the 767 and the eight or oh, three planes, A330, 767, and the Hurricane Hunter. All right. So once you locate your community folder, right over here, let's go ahead and go to the website and download the C17 Globe Master. There's a lot of a lot of people do it differently. A lot of uh, developers, that creators from the planes, they pack up their uh, files differently so let me show you how to actually uh, install it so as you can see here you have images of in game see how they uh, see how they look and all that so it's pretty freaking cool all right so once you download now do you need an account so you got to create an account so obviously the main file is the most uh, updated one so we're gonna download that we're gonna wait a few seconds here for all the files to be ready for download So to start download, so just save it on the location. So what you're gonna do is open the file. You have it right over here. We can close the website now. Uh, we're gonna put side by side here comparison. So a lot of uh, community files. They uh, here. Let me open another one so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Okay. So this is a great example one. So this one here, the P3 series aircraft. Do you think this is the actual folder you got to drag into your community folder? Don't. So you may want to open it because they put, you know, pictures here how the aircraft look. And this is the actual folder of the aircraft. So it might be inside of another folder. This is not your aircraft folder. It's this one here. So you have to make sure you open the files correctly. So this one's the one you're going to drag. Because if you drag this one, you're going to drag all this thing in there. And your plane is not going to be working properly. Okay. So... For example, this one, the Glow 17 Master, the C17, it's already done that. They, they put all the files together, so all you got to do is drag this folder into your community folder. Let it process. All right, once your folder has been uh, exported, you're gonna close everything else. We need to close the game and relaunch because we need the game to read the files, to read the new files. Um, I don't know why my game is acting funny. All right, so we're gonna click to desktop, yes, and we're going to relaunch our 
game. All right, so welcome back after my game crash. So this is a C-17 Glowmaster. Check the inside copy real quick. Actually, it's pretty freaking cool. It's a bit laggy. I have a 3070 Ti, but you know, that's all you can get. Let's see how this baby takes off. Sounds amazing. The C-17 can have a takeoff on a 3000 runway. Look at that. Alright guys, this is how you install a custom aircraft into fly simulator and locating your community folder. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to drop down a like, comment. If you got any questions, leave a comment down below. And uh, see you guys later.